Hey everybody, quick uh, video showing off the new RMR CC. I'll give you uh, my opinions on that site uh, at the end of the video, so if, um, if you're only here for the RMR review, jump to the end of the video. But this is an Athena, um, of course it's got our RDS plate system, um, there's an SRO on here that was um, that's just been on here for uh, show purposes while we did some videos. I'm going to remove that and I'm going to hook this SRO CC up. But I wanted to kind of put the two in the same video so that you could see the visually see the difference um, in size. They're they're pretty different. So we need a different plate. The CC runs its own pattern. We're probably one of the first companies at this point to have an RMR plate for the CC. I believe those are on the website at this moment already. So the plate comes off. Um, I've just got this thing pinned in here. Now most of the time with almost every plate at Atlas Gunworks for the optic system we run our own um, screws that mount the sight to the plate. In the case of the CC, they use um, a, a weird pattern and specialty screws, so we, we actually set that up to run the actual Trigicon screws. So the CC is the only one that we won't send screws with, you're going to use your Trigicon screws, and that's partly because of this bump up. So these plates are, are uh, the pins are located on the outside for these, so our locator pins that keep, and what those pins do, or in this case these pins that are threaded in the middle, um, is that when the gun's recoiling, there's a fair amount of yaw backwards, and it just the pin, just the screws alone end up shearing. So some kind of pin system is required to make that work the way it's supposed to. This will come back off. So normally I put a little Loctite on here, but I just want to give you the... Now the cool part about the CC is that it's narrower, and so it's almost about the width of a 1911, so it does not hang over nearly as much. And, so the f and then the footprint is really pretty great. And it's a little smaller for pulling out of the holsters as well. I think for competition world, you're gonna see the SRO still dominate there. That's um, probably, it's my favorite site for that. Uh, I think the combination of the dot clarity and the SRO as well as um, the way it functions, the window size, uh, and the reliability. It is by far and away my favorite, um, especially slide mounted site. So SRO for slide mounted competition stuff. When we talk about carry, this is actually quite a bit smaller. Um, when you hold this gun up, you get uh, the full use of the rear sight because the deck here is just a tad lower. Um, so the sights optics are optics plates in the, um, are always set up to co -wit or not co-witness, but be like a uh, two-thirds witness with a, um, or one-third witness, I should say, with the, all the Trigicon products. And so this is a nice little compact site. Um, it does all the things it needs to do. It puts a dot there. It's not quite as fast as the bigger ones, but if your draw is consistent, um, it will do everything you need to do. And it's gonna be a little narrower and a little shorter and that snag, you know, less snagging, less uh, getting in the way, also less bulky and it looks really good on the site. So, big fan of the CC. I think if you're worried about size, that's um, something that's important. If you're, uh, if you're not worried about size and you're doing competition and you're gonna shoot the gun a lot, then I think you go with an SRO. And of course, in the middle of these two, not present here today, I have a, you know, you could run the RMR. But the CC fits a really nice build. I think if I was gonna carry every day and I wanted a dot, I would look hard at the CC. So. Um, Hands off to Trigicon. They did a really great job with the CC. I think the thing to keep in mind here is that it's a smaller footprint and it does not share a footprint with um, the other RMR and SRO sites, which are all the same plate system. So you need to have a specialty plate to make it work, but as long as you have that, it works out really well and it's a nice little site. Hope to see you guys on the range soon.